check out what's coming up in the latest issue of Checkpoints Magazine. Captain Christy Wise, class of 09, shares her story of a boating accident that led to the loss of her leg, and how the support of her fellow airmen has inspired her to serve other amputees, both in the Air Force and other parts of the world. So I always felt like I was part of the long blue line. That is hands down true, and I feel like this just illustrated that to the 10th degree. So I just expect great things from the Air Force now in general, and the flying community and myself been kind of pushed to the edge and I realize I can accomplish so much more than I think I can. Plus, Darren Ellisor, class of 97, recounts his harrowing experience as first officer aboard Southwest Flight 1380, and how his instincts helped to safely land the severely damaged plane in Philadelphia. There was a very loud bang. Uh, we had a very severe vibration on the aircraft. Really, my training just kicked in. I've been preparing for something like this my whole uh, aviation career, and, and that's what I was supposed to do. And the long blue line is now more than 50,000 strong. Hear from graduates across all eras of USAFA, from the first, Bradley Hosmer, class of 1959, to the 50,000th, second Lieutenant Farley Pipkins, class of 2018. All of this and more, the next issue of Checkpoints Magazine, coming to you this month.